just to maybe on a bigger picture, so brain metastases or central nervous system metastases and melanoma um, have been a huge issue for, for many years, just simply because melanoma of all the solid tumors, for example, breast cancer, lung cancer, colon cancer, has the highest likelihood of actually metastasizing or spreading to the central nervous system, which includes the brain, but also the leptomeninges. And over the last three years, we have seen really some fantastic breakthroughs in the treatment of patients with brain metastases. So it's when it's kind of inside of the brain. However, for patients, when the disease spreads to the lining of the brain, that's called the leptomeninges or the lining of the, of the spinal uh, canal, um, that has a really, really poor prognosis. And we really haven't found any therapies that work very well in these patients. And historically, we would say that patients typically only live a few weeks, uh, maybe six to eight. We recently um, reviewed um, about 178 patients that we've seen here at Emmy Anderson over years, um, and all with melanoma LMD. And the overall survival and average was still only 3.5 months. So the rationale of why choosing LMD, it's uh, just what my mentor did, and I took over his work and um, kind of continued working um, for this really um, patient population that has been kind of ignored or where there aren't really great therapies.